Hi, I'm Karmi Shammas. I'm your astrologer. Today I'll be talking about Saturday, the 5th of November. Today the moon is in Aries. It's a beautiful day if you're uh, a fire sign, if you're Aries, uh, Sagittarius, Leo also if you're Gemini, and if you are also uh, Aquarius. How's it going to be for all signs? Let's start with Aries. Definitely Aries, today you have the, uh, the last uh, say, meaning that you can be very decisive. You know what you're doing. You know that uh, things will turn out to be quite fine and as expected. Uh, maybe it was tough in the past two days, Thursday and Friday, but today something is coming up and you seem to enjoy what you're doing. Everybody can be lucky today, especially if you were born in the month of March. Taurus, this is a slow day, definitely, and uh, astrologically, it's one of the least lucky days, astrologically, in the month of November, which is basically a tough month. So uh, what is it like today? It can be a slow day, definitely. It can be disappointing. It can be confusing. Uh, you can expect maybe maybe you may expect some misunderstandings and um, uh, something that is a bit confusing in a way dealing with people. So you have you need a plan B just in case. So pay attention, be more careful, not only Saturday, also Sunday. Moving to uh, Gemini. Gemini, it's a fine day. It's a long, busy day. It's a busy Saturday. Things need to be well done. Things need to be um, uh, uh, organized, prioritized, and then everything will be fine. It's just planet Mars, which is in your sign that can cause some trouble, especially if you were born on the 16th, 17th of June. Uh, so just be more careful. With, planet, with the moon in Aries, all Geminis can expect help, support, and uh, uh, some uh, co extra collaboration. So it can be, at the end, a nice fine day. Not only Saturday, but also Sunday. Moving to Cancer, it's a fine day with the moon in the highest point in your sky. And coming to Saturday uh, with all the push and all the good luck that you took, all the, the great positive vibes that you got on Thursday and Friday. I think today should be a very successful day, a lot of achievements, great achievements, and you really need to know how to handle stuff because the moon is in the highest point in your sky, meaning that something may pop up, something important, and you really need to know how to handle things flexibly. Moving to Leo, um, uh, maybe Tuesday and Wednesday were quite um, uh, difficult, complicated, frustrating. Uh, I think today is a time, today, Saturday, may give you uh, um, an opportunity to make it up to yourself, to hurry up, maybe to wrap things up, to get things done. Uh, it gives you a push, a nice push. It helps you to feel better. It, uh, it uh, kind of motivates you. So today is a fine day to stand up on your feet and you should make the best of every favorable day during November, especially during the first three weeks of November. So today is a fine day. It stands by you. It's uh, entertaining. It's friendly. And definitely it's... Um, it's a rewarding day. So you have no problem whatsoever with this day. Just be extra careful if you were born on the 12th, 13th of August. Moving to Virgo, it's it's a good day. Uh, after the um, maybe the, the ups and downs, maybe of Thursdays and Fridays, today is a good day. You have things to handle. You have things to settle down. You have things to discuss and you have things to wrap up. Maybe it's, uh, it's a busy day, which is fine. But the uh, sun and Mercury and Venus, which are in, um, in Scorpio, uh, they will help you. They will help you definitely. They will speed up your reflexes and you'll be able to get things done in a click of an eye. Moving to Libra, it's uh, a nice day with the Sun, Mercury, Venus in the second house. Uh, second house of money, things are moving fast. And with the Moon in uh, Aries in the seventh house, gives you a lot of potential, a lot of energy, but you really need to discuss things flexibly using all the Libra traits and skills that you have, uh, things can be done successfully. Just make sure that you give and take, give and take, and then things will sort themselves out in a beautiful way. Not only Saturday, but also on Sunday. You can be extremely lucky if you were born on the 12th and 13th of October. Let's move now to Scorpio. Scorpio, this is a very long day. 
it's because the moon is in the sixth house, which is the sixth, which is the house of work, which is which is the house of uh, health. Maybe because it's a Saturday, it's uh, a day off, and you have so many chores to do related to family, related to house, related to maybe you work, you're doing extra hours. So it can be a bit busy. It can be a bit um, uh, exhausting physically, but it's, it's okay. Uh, Venus is in your sign. You can be very lucky if you were born um, or between the 4th and the 6th of November. Let's move now to Sagittarius. The moon in Aries, a fire sign, is everything you need now because it gives you all the energy that you need, that you lack. Um, it's... Uh, it's it's the sun which is basic which is in in, Sagitt in in Scorpio that makes you feel a bit down or a bit late to anything. So today the moon in a fire sign in in, in Aries gives you a big push. And that's why you have to make all those calls. Maybe you have to do some commuting. Maybe you need to communicate with people. You need to make things right. So today is a good day. Not only Saturday, but also Sunday. So that would be a great uh, opportunity for you to make things right again. Let's move now to Capricorn. Capricorn, this is a great day. Maybe... Uh, maybe because it's a Saturday, you have things, family things, family reunions, gatherings. Maybe you're, you're going out to the market for a long day. Uh, you have things to settle. You have house chores. Uh, I think today is a, a busy day. It can be exhausting physically, but I think it can be fine. Mercury, Venus, and the sun in Scorpio will help you, will give you all the push, and Uranus in um, and Taurus will help you a lot, especially if you were born on the 7th, 8th of January. Moving to Aquarius, you need this push, Aquarius. Definitely, you are uh, a great candidate. You're a great competitor. The moon in the third house gives you all the reflexes, gives you all the push, gives you all the energy to discuss, to commute, to travel, to uh, renovate, to update. You're very active. You're, 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 you participate. You're, you're, you're very optimistic. The sun, which is in Scorpio, the highest point in your sky, gives you the potential to be a success story today. It's a Saturday, so all in all, it's a fine, busy, long day. Moving to Pisces. Pisces, this is a beautiful, gorgeous day. The moon in the second house of money, second house of rewards, uh, will actually reward you with all the positive vibes, all this great energy that you took um, on Thursday and Friday with the moon in your sign. So today you have no excuse whatsoever to say that nothing, nothing is working. Everything should work to your benefit. Try not to be over, over, uh, over, uh, um, spending, you know, just try to make sure that you're putting your money, putting your resources in the right place. This is a great day. Maybe you'll have some great news. You can be extremely lucky. That's planet Jupiter talking. You can be extremely lucky with Jupiter near your sign if you were born between the 18th and the 20th of March. That's great. Okay. So basically, this is it. I wish you all a beautiful, gorgeous Saturday. We meet tomorrow, Sunday. So long. Bye-bye.